making the chicken. So I finally get here and I'm a little big. <laughs> but we're not gonna talk about that. This is gonna be positive vibes. Chicken. I'm I just scooped out the avocado and I'm about to smash it to make the guac. What's up amigas gang? We are it's amigas and, and today guys welcome back <laughs> Welcome back guys. If you're new to our channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. If you like Mexican food, hit that like button. If you like Chipotle, hit that like button. If you like making your own bowl, hit that like button. If you love food, hit that like button. For real. So guys, today basically we prepared our own chipotles as you guys seen earlier on in the video. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm starving, so I'm just gonna get right into it. Mmm. This shit is cooking. Like, we could dead sell this. <laughs> but I'm about to start charging $10. Not even $15. Bro. Wow. I might fuck it if this is mad, mad good. Guys, so our topic for today, we're gonna talk about punchlines that people like try to use or what? Use. Like, sometimes it's really tough being a girl because you have to deal with like people throwing themselves, but you don't want to be mean at the same time. Cause like, mm -hmm. there's no other feeling than like feeling, you know, like hi, then you just say your name and then, no, sorry, I have a boyfriend. I feel really bad, like, when people come up and they, like, well, over here, over here, he's most likely with a crew of friends, and he told his friend prior, you know, niggas call, call out who they want so the other nigga won't get her. So, I feel bad that the friends be looking from a distance. But then to you just give attitude like, ew, nigga, get out of my face. I would never do that. Oh, when a friend sends a friend? No, like, let's say, um, let's say it's me, you, and Jenny. Mm-hmm. And Jenny goes back to the nigga. She's mm -hmm. gonna be like, oh, yo, I'm gonna go back to that nigga. And we're gonna be staring at her like, ooh, let's see what happens. I feel like that happens with guys. The niggas are looking to see if they back the girl. <sighs> or sometimes bad. guys make, make bets. I bet, nigga, I bet you $20 you can't bag that. Mm hmm So that's there. Oh, shit. I'm really expecting. So I don't like to just be on some bitch shit. I mean, I kindly deny. The the thing I hate, though, is when, like, a friend goes up for a friend. I thought that's what you were talking about. That's when they send somebody, like, oh, cool, my bro. friend thinks that like, you're cute. Now like, I'm denying you. Because now I can tell your friend that you're dumb. <laughs> With no problem. <laughs> No, no I'm <laughs> Like, 
Like, bro, you can't bag a girl by yourself? Get out. Don't even come near me. That's hilarious, yo. Mm -hmm. There's so much pressure for that. So much pressure. Do I feel bad. Like, 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 honestly, like, they really like, gotta go up to them. Yeah, it's like, oh, it's like they have to go up. Like, they really can't do no... Because when you get at a, to a certain age, like, once you're in your, like, mid-20s, uh, like, that sending friend shit, that's... That's out. That's not it. Like, you're, ch you're a child if you send your friend to go try to bag someone for you. Because you guys can see I put my really put down already. <laughs> yeah, that's my wife. No, I feel like there. I feel like the East Coast pickup lines be out here, but just be like, I feel like they be like, oh, you're beautiful. I feel like they first say what the you're beautiful, right, and then they pause for a little bit, then they come sometimes back. Sometimes I feel like sometimes. You like right. lately, my approach has been the approach for me has been, why you look so mad? You really you're not enjoying yourself. They just start a conversation. What you come here for? Yeah, and I'm like, oh, and I say the same thing. It's like a rehearsal already. It's like I'm rehearsing the same now. Oh, I'm just not really the type to go out like that. Like, shut up! For real. Who cares if I look bored? Yeah, Why but the, that's, they use that a lot. Oh, you're not drinking? You don't, you know, you don't want to dance. What's anything? your name? Where you from? Mm -hmm. You're from here? you from here? No, it's damn well. Probably see you mad times. <laughs> mm-hmm. What part? Oh, you from from Prague? Like, yeah, you live one too. street over from me. What are you talking about? What part? I have to have a hard freaking what's that word called? Freaking dub demeanor? No, um, a dub game? Dub game, yo, cause they sheesh. Sometimes people be mad nice. Like I, I like. Okay, you can follow me on Instagram or something. Not only that, but then there's people. Man, man, man. Mm. And and it's your booth friends are around, so you're like, what the? But it's snitched on and do nothing. Mm -hmm. Like stay away from me, cause these niggas is locking your on you. Like, like I'm watching your ass. So you go snitch. All right, that's been going on. I be waiting to hear some news about me, but I just sat there the whole fucking night. But that's just where we're from. Like we're, um, we're all depopular. <laughs> Clearly. Um. Mm. Mm -mm. If if you're in a relationship, you can be mad that people come up to you. Like you just can't control that part. You know what I mean? Like no, you can't. You can't control somebody coming up to you. Like honestly, I'm not a mean person, so I can never make somebody feel completely bad. Like you know no, what I mean? Like that's that. fucking that's awful. Fun. Like. Who are you to be like that? You know what I mean? Who are you to be like, ew, like, get away from me. Like, I would never, oh my God, oh, I would never. No, that's so mean. Be like, hey, my name is Amanda, because I always say Amanda. No, it's just Stephanie. Amanda, where you from? Oh, you know. <laughs> I don't even know. I'd be thinking in the moment where I'm from. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. I'm like, yeah, yeah. And then I'd be like, I give my friends the eyes. Like, save me. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and we pretty much all know what's up. Like, we just include ourselves in each conversation. Mm -hmm. And it becomes the us thing. And that's you nice. ladies having fun? Yeah! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> yeah. What you guys doing after? Like, oh, yeah. <laughs> you mean, like, oh, buy me a drink and just keep it pushing. <laughs> Buy all shot. If not, just go because I can buy my own drink without your disturbance. At least give me a drink for your disturbance. Some people that be cool though and just will will get the picture. And they'll just be cool. And they'll try to get with you. Like this one time where I went to this place and there was like this short guy. Way shorter than me. And I'm short, guys. I'm short. He's like, You're just beautiful. I'm gonna get you a drink. He's like, I don't even want to talk to you on your Instagram, but that's sad. I'm like, bad, fuck it, get me a thing then. <laughs> no, honestly, it's fine. I was like, bad? And then the fact that the person didn't even come up to me and ask me no questions, I was like, yo, you're fire, my guy. Hell yeah. You're fire for that. Yo, sometimes it'd be so bad 
that you can peep from across the, 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 what's it called, the club. You can peep one nigga got his eyes on you. And you see him coming towards you and be like, yo, 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 come in front of me, come in front of me. Yo! Start walking, walk, walk, and walk, hurry. Like, but yeah, guys. I got a pop of Please, if you really, really want to talk to somebody, the way that it works, and of course if they're single, you go up to them, you say, don't try I to think, get with them. Just say, I think you're very pretty. They'll say, thank you. Um, what are you drinking? If you don't ask what are you drinking, like, I say no a lot of the times, little do you guys know. It's not even about the money or nothing, but it's just, like, common courtesy. I, a lot of the times, at least 95% of the time, I say, no, I'm okay, thank you. I don't really drink like that. Or mm -hmm. I have a drink in my hand and I'm already good. Oh, and then they'll insist, like, oh, no, let me buy it. Come on, just like, okay, then maybe sometimes I'll take it. But a lot of the times, some girls won't take it. So I think it's very important that you guys just, because oh, if not, nobody, no guy wants to be with a broke-ass bitch and no woman wants to be with a broke-ass nigga. Mm -hmm. That's just, that's just top of top. Who? Who wants to be? A guy can't tell me he wants to be with a broke ass bitch that doesn't have to maintain. You can't tell me that. Mm -hmm. And same with girls. I don't want to. I, I don't want your money, but I don't want to know that you're broke. If that yep. makes sense. And don't look at that bill like, damn. How much? Like, nigga, mm -hmm. you just offered. You better fucking pay and shut up and talk about it later. Call the bank and say you didn't do it. That's like. When you get older, that's just what you do. You, If you ever go, if you're, let's say, 23 years old, and you go somewhere and you think of a girl's pretty, and you don't offer them a drink, my God. You ain't got a chance. Even 21, like, I feel like 21, they'd be like, ooh, I just turned 21. Fuck it, I'm just going to buy drinks on for myself. You know, I feel like at that age, it's just, guys are not really thinking about but 23, I feel like 22, you get a little bit of experience. 23. 23 is just it already. Like, if you're not me. buying. Oh, I'm so full. So I'm, uh, I'm full as fuck, but I'm not going to stop eating just yet. Yeah, if you're 23 and you don't do it, you got to know what's up at this point. Like, you just have to. Yeah, if, if, if you don't buy, a, you uh, tell the girl she's beautiful. You buy her a drink, ask her what she's drinking, if she says no, whatever, if she says, I'm drinking this. Don't, if she says you, I'm drinking this, don't say, oh, okay. Don't ask her if she wants another one. You just order it. Like, a same drink. And they're going to be like, oh my god, thank you. Mm -hmm. Like, I guarantee you. And, they're gonna, and then they're going to be like, oh, you're welcome, no problem. And then... Uh, walk away, yo, walk away. I'm pretty sure you're going to have that girl's interest after. They're going to be like... Wow, who was that? That's if you're cute, too, because if you're ugly, I'm sorry. <laughs> Depending on if they like this, is somebody not, you know? for everybody, so you never know. Just you're give right. it a shot. After that, walk away, and then uh, along the party, just keep go partying with your friends who have. Don't be a fucking creep all day the next all the whole night. That's my fucking yes. Like, get out. You eventually make your way back. Like, oh, are you enjoying yourself? Then the girls are very comfortable to say a little couple more words to you. Then you do what you gotta do from there. That's perfect. Exactly. Ideal. Because you already got a drink. And don't be mad if you got a boyfriend. But yeah, guys. Thank you guys for watching this mukbang slash... 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 Um, hey, guys. Awesome. Slash... Talk... Slash... Cook with us. Um, But yeah, guys. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys next time. If you guys really enjoyed this video, let us know down below, okay? And if you want to see Peace. it. Peace. Fire shit on the way. Peace. <laughs> Bye. Bye.